I'm Shannon. This is Del. And you're watching Drinking. And Yakin. Hey! <laughs> <laughs> Cheers, Del. Cheers. Hi, guys. Happy Halloween. Hope you're having an awesome Wednesday. Happy Hump Day. <sighs> I'm not going to drink as much as I did on the last show, by the way. Yeah. Ooh. For those of you that don't know, we were on Facebook Live. We were on Facebook Live beforehand, and now we are on Twitch. This is my very first time being on Twitch. So, uh, yay! I Welcome. hope you guys enjoy the show. Thank you. <laughs> um, so, what the show is all about, if you haven't seen it before, it's pretty much just us, literally what the title says, drinking and yakking. So, <laughs> who knows what could be in these mugs? Yeah. It could be there's, beer, well, yeah, beer, ginger yeah. ale. <laughs> That's the kicker. Yeah. It doesn't even have to be booze. It could be, uh, again, ginger ale, milk, coffee, tea, whatever suits your needs. Mm -hmm. There's no judgment, whatever. As long as you have some sort of a beverage in your hands and we can all communicate <laughs> about anything you guys want, mm -hmm. depending on the situation. If it's politics, eh, maybe not. That's but nice. um, I will talk about almost... Pretty much anything. Pop culture, the weather, how your day was. I can be your personal therapist without pay, <laughs> but that's okay. Well, hold on. Sorry. We need we, we should clarify. Hmm. Uh, for those of you who normally have seen the show before, um, Shannon is going to be hosting her own show. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. It's part of the drinking and yakking umbrella, but she's going to be hosting her own. And this is her first opportunity to do that. I'm in the wrong chair. Because I got to sort through some candies because we're going to be getting ready for tomorrow. Yes, yeah, so we're going to be getting ready yeah. for Halloween and the trick or treaters. Yeah. So, so I... let's switch. Let's switch. All right. Here, you sit. You sit in the good chair. All right, I gotta, <laughs> I'm going to sit in the big boy chair. That's right. That's right. And and we'll do this properly. Okay. All right. Here we go. <laughs> <laughs> we should have taken an intermission <laughs> on this one. All right. <laughs> Who knows? We'll play that intermission oh. later. All right. Now All right. we're set. Oh, oh no, we're beautiful. Not. No, we're not. <laughs> <laughs> we've got, there we go. Always technical difficulties. All right, here we go. <laughs> Once we go. again, it's my first time on Twitch, so uh, bear with me. Um, yeah, so it's Halloween. Um, in case you guys haven't noticed, or um, if you guys know the show Good Omens, it's on Amazon Prime. I don't have it personally because I'm too poor to get it. Um, <laughs> so if you know the show, it has uh, Michael Sheen and David Tennant. So I'm David Tennant's character, Crowley. Hence the glasses. It looks awesome. <laughs> I love it. I love these glasses. They're so awesome. <laughs> um, yeah, so this is pretty much my little get up for the evening. But um, I can't see anything, so I'm going to take them off for now. <laughs> and guys, feel free to make comments. Uh, we're always willing to read the comments if we get any. Shannon's going to be hosting her own thing. Now, my show is usually Tuesdays at 9 on yes. Facebook. And sometimes I'll come over here. Well, actually, so far we've done it twice, and I've come here both times. <laughs> so um, she's going to be doing her own thing. And then afterwards, I don't know if you're going to be doing Twitch as well, but we're going to set her up. Yeah. And we're going to figure out a day. Uh, yes. Yeah. Um, my work schedule is all is like all over the place. So it, I want to say, I want to give you folks at least a week in advance on when I want to do my show. Um, so my work schedule is pretty much from Wednesday. And I'm sorry, Wednesday. Monday to Friday, um, I pretty much work until at least 6.30, if not 7. So I want to say my window of opportunity will be between 7 and 10. Um, my weekend is very out in the open. Some, sometimes I have to close nights at 11. So there are times where I won't want to do it after after work. Which so, makes sense. That makes yeah, sense. like who would want to like broadcast after work? I mean, I wouldn't want to. So, um... Yeah, so I'm going to give you guys a heads up, but if there's a chance that I can't do a show, I will obviously give you Notion saying that I can't do it. But pretty much what I'm going to be doing is what I'm doing right now. I'm going to be doing it on my own, which is a little scary because I'm very shy. I'm very closed up, but I want to say this is like, I want to break out of my shell. Don't fear. She's going to be fine. <laughs> fear in the Reaper. You're going to be fine. I'll she's, be all right. She's done a lot of shows with me in the past. She's good to go. Yeah, like, I thought yeah. about this on my own, and I was like, you know what? I can do this. And, like, I can talk about almost anything and everything. So, I'm not worried. So, yeah, Halloween's coming up. Uh, we want to hear about your comments. What's your favorite candy, your favorite horror movie, your favorite costume when you were a kid, or even now? I mean, if you're a grown adult, who do you like dressing up as? We want to know what your comments are. 
And what I'm doing is I'm separating out the candies that I don't want to give to the kids. <laughs> because we went out and bought a shitload of candy. And I like certain brands. Of, and I normally don't get these chocolates because obviously, you know, normally you don't buy that in your grocery list. But <laughs> I decided, you know what? If I'm going to give out these treats, I'm going to separate the ones that I want and give the kids the crap that I don't want. <laughs> but we're still going to give them chocolates. Like, I don't like Smarties. So, yeah, I need this. <laughs> Me personally, I'll eat almost anything but, like... I'm not a big fan of peanuts. Like I don't like um, I don't like M&M's peanuts. I don't like Mr. Bigs, but I can handle. Oh. Woo. How how could you? But I can handle. It's okay. More for me. <laughs> but I can handle <laughs> I can handle Snickers because Snickers is like covered in like caramel and nougat and chocolate and all that awesome stuff. Yeah. And the Mars. <laughs> these Sorry, my, it's not Snickers, but it's close enough. These are also my favorite. Um. <laughs> I thought you were going to eat it. No, I don't want to eat it on the air. That's rude. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> if, it, if we were eating, then it would be, drink, be drinking and eating. Sure. And yakking. That's a new show. Drinking and eating. And yakking. <laughs> <laughs> right. 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 Yeah. So, um, yeah. So, when I do my own show, I'm pretty much going to talk about anything. I mean, like, literally anything. Like, it doesn't even have to be about pop culture. It could be about the weather. How your day is. Like, if you're having a good day, we'll talk. If you're having a crappy day, lend an ear. I can, I can talk. If, I can, we can talk about it. Um, also, there's, I, I mentioned on this other show, and I'm really into it. Um, four words. I'm sorry, not four words. Four letters. A S M R. What's that? <laughs> um, pretty much what it is. It's. Um, I have no idea what she's talking about. It's the <laughs> sensation and the relaxation of just like the crinkliness of like a paper bag <gasps> or latex gloves. Example. Show us. Show us. Example. Yeah. ASMR. Right yeah. here. Ooh. <laughs> right there, I'm all folks. tingly. <laughs> right there, folks. I don't. I've been into it since like about a year and a half ago, and. It just feels really good, like, okay, example, if you go to the doctors and you need to get your ears checked out, they put in that otoscope, just the feeling and the sound of it going into your ear, I mean, it sounds really weird, but, like, oh. from a different perspective, it's, it feels really good, and, like, it relaxes you, like, if you're having trouble sleeping, it helps you put you to sleep, even though that's not what they want, but that's probably what they do want, but, um. It's not like those eating videos, though, is it? It can those be. Those kind of weird me out a little it bit. It can be. Well, depending on what you're talking about, like, there is yeah. ASMR eating videos. Like, I've seen videos of people eating fried chicken. You know, the crunchiness of it. Um, I've seen videos of people eating pickles. It's just, just the sound of it. Just the crunch of it. It just makes it feel so good. What's that, box number four? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm still going. Oh, my God. But those shows kind of weird me out a little bit. It's a little yeah. weird because you're watching people eat. Yeah. It's a little weird. I get that. Also, it makes you really hungry. You know, I got to say this, though, because whenever I'm at a restaurant and I'm sitting there with somebody mm -hmm. and, like, I'm having a beer or whatever and they're eating mm -hmm. and I don't have shit because I can't afford to buy any meals, <laughs> you know, and meanwhile, they're eating in front of me and I'm sitting there like, you bastard. Like, can't you know, that burger looks good. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> This is cool blooded, man. That's cool. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> no, it's cool though, cause it, cause it's fun though, cause like whenever I watch these things, like I know what they're eating, and I'm just like, dang, I just want to go around the corner and get a burger and fries, you know? Right. So it's just like, dang, I want to enjoy it with you guys. <laughs> um, but yeah, it's not even about the food. Like even if it's like latex gloves or if it's like paper, it's just the feeling of just that sound in your ear. It just. <laughs> Exactly, <laughs> exactly, and I'm not, I'm not gonna lie, like, I've been wanting to maybe start doing something like that, but I'm like, if it's a food thing, I'd just be like, nom, 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 and like, screw you guys, I'm just gonna eat my food and bye. <laughs> That's what a lot of people do, and you know what, they're pretty popular at that shit. They're so popular, yeah. they get a lot of views, Tons. and yeah, and a lot of subscribers, so. It's scary. It's, it's, it's a weird concept, but like, I'm obsessed with it, but that's gonna be one of the things I want to talk about, like, on one of my fewer shows, once I get into this. And I can't wait for her to get involved. And we just got to find the right time, the right date, like she was That's saying earlier. That's the thing, yeah. yeah. It's going to be a little sporadic, so yeah. bear with me, folks. It's going to be at, like, the really weird time. It's mostly <laughs> going to be evening shows. Yeah. Well, we want something consistent. So we want exactly, you guys yeah. to know when she's going to be on. And she's, 
See, here's the thing is we're going to be doing Drinking and Yak, and I'm going to be doing my Tuesday show. She's going to have her own time slot. And what's going to happen is I do my show, she does her show, and it's just under the same umbrella. Exactly, yeah. Shannon Graham, Drinking and Yakking, yeah. right? Yeah. So I actually, um, I got to I gotta welcome Shannon to the hosting team. <laughs> I actually, we made her a moderator on Facebook, and now she's got the ability to post a show whenever she wishes. Yeah. So welcome to the Drinking and Yakking. I want to give my lady a hug. Yeah, and actually we are together. I think you want to give me a handshake. Oh no, no! Come on, I'm, I'm with you. <laughs> What's wrong? Like, What's hey, wrong? Oh, the club. Oh, she's ring. Oh, that was so late. Look at my handshake. No, come on. <laughs> she's my lady. She's been my lady for a while, and we used to do radio show back when I used to do my radio five, show. Almost five years, folks. Yeah, and she was very, very shy. I barely said anything. Barely, and yeah. then uh, it took her a while to come out of her shell. But when she did, people were asking for her. <laughs> okay. And that says something right there. I'm like, oh, my God, people are actually asking for me. And I'm like, oh, my God, I have fans. And I said this before in a previous show, and I got to say it again. But I said, I go, if you guys think you, do, you can do better, chances are you can. <laughs> she can do better. And I know you can. <laughs> I'm and, sorry. And I'm sorry. <laughs> And I'm sure there's going to be times where I'm doing my thing by myself, and I'm sure there'll be people going, where's Del? Right. <laughs> that always happens. It happens. Every time we go anywhere without each other. It's true, because I go to a lot of Comic-Cons. Yeah. I love going to conventions, and there are times where he can't make it, and I'm there by myself. Yep. Legitimately, anyone that knows us together, <laughs> if I'm there on my own, they'll be like, where's Del? Where's Del? Where's Del? And I'm like... I get more questions about her than she probably gets questions about me. Because everybody wants to see her. They don't get, the only question I, I get, yeah, the only question. Actually, there's two questions that I get about him. Where is he? And what's his job? Oh, and you bastard. And you bastard, yeah. <laughs> that actually made my day because three people were asking, where's that bastard? Because that's sort of my thing, you know. Look at all this shit. Look. I don't need that many smarties. Oh my god! That's all. Dude, their kids are gonna be happy. Kids are gonna be awesome. Boy, they're gonna lose their be shit. So happy with the smarties. Do you want the smarties? I don't mind them. All right. If you guys want smarties, let us know. We'll email you some. <laughs> <laughs> unless it, unless it's in Canada, I don't know if they can accept it across the border. Oh no, we'll we'll figure it out. Yeah, we'll figure it out. Yeah, as long as it's not Kinders, because because uh, Kinders are uh, illegal in the states. I'm sorry. Continue. Talk talk about what you're gonna talk on the show. <laughs> Give us, give us a sample of what you're going to talk about on like on your show. Okay, well, besides the SMR stuff, that's just something that I'm really interested in. Um, yeah, actually, going back to Comic-Cons. I love going to cons. I started going to them when I was, no, not when I was, but probably around 2015. Wow. Don't quote me. My I've been to a lot, so they all meshed in together. Um, my first con was actually in Toronto, Fan Expo. Holy crap. <laughs> You too. I, I should have <laughs> started off with like the really small cons because <laughs> this was like extravagant beyond belief. Oh, wait, you went to 2015? I, don't quote me. And maybe this is when I was dating. Oh, yeah. No, that's when it was like because back, back in the day, the Fan X was small. Okay. So, yeah. Yeah. This, yeah so, it got bigger and bigger and bigger. So, yeah. So, yeah. I want to say maybe 2014, 2015. Um, and my first costume to do was Stargate. Nice. Bad choice. Oh, not nice. Because, like, I looked good. Don't get me wrong. But if you watch Stargate, <laughs> there's a lot of gear you got to wear. It's heavy. I had to wear, like, prop guns. I had to carry a prop gun. And I'm like, <sighs> it was awful. That's a good face. <laughs> <laughs> Do it again. <laughs> <laughs> um... <laughs> And so, like... She's fine. She'll, she'll do good. I got <laughs> I got all the faith in this lady. She's going to kick ass. Yeah, that'll be fine. Yeah. Anyway, so, um... Yeah, Comic-Cons. Like, that one was really fun, but I... That's when I was just like, why am I starting with such a big con first? Like, I just start with, like, the very small ones and then progress to the big ones. Mm -hmm. Um... Sorry, it's really hot in here. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we got some lights It's really hot in here, down. sorry, guys. They're coming not... down hard. <laughs> um... But yeah, I love I, I love to cosplay. I have a few costumes that I, that I do regularly. I do have a few ideas for next year that I'm very excited for. Um, one's going to cost me a fortune, and one's probably going to cost me less than five dollars. Oh. 
I'd so, go with the cheaper one. I'm, I'm, gonna, <laughs> I'm yeah. gonna start off with the cheaper one first, and then I'm gonna start, slowly progress to the expensive one. There you go. Uh, but yeah, if you guys go to cons, if you guys cosplay, let us know. Yeah. Yeah, you yeah. know what to do. We'd love to hear your comments. That's right. Hear your comments. Read your comments. I need a refill. Uh oh. So I'm gonna get another beer. All right. I'll be right back. All right. Actually, no, we're not gonna play that right now. We'll no, we'll we're okay. We'll but can you, go. I'm sorry. Go, go on. Continue. <laughs> do you have any more boxes of candy to sort? Yeah, I do. Oh boy. No, don't worry. I'm busy. I'm busy. <laughs> all right. Look, look at all them lucky bastards gonna get that chocolate. So much smarties. <laughs> My God. I'm gonna be known for the house of smarties. <laughs> yeah, because you're a smart ass. That's whoa, like that. Wah, wah. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> sorry, beer break. Ah, it's good stuff. So yeah, like if you guys want to join in, like I said, it doesn't have to be an alcoholic drink, but if it is an alcoholic drink, don't drive, please. I beg of you. That's going to be one of my main things whenever I do the show is just to not plain do it. If you're drinking, be at home, be at a friend's house. If you're going to crash, or even call a cab home. Just, it's so simple. Just don't do it. I don't know. I understand why it's so difficult for certain people that decide to drink and drive because if you read the news, all hell breaks loose. And that's one of the reasons why I hate watching the news because almost every single segment is about someone crashing and burning and dying and we don't want that. And this is one of the reasons why the show is happening because the world is such shambles and there's so much stuff happening in our lives that are just bad and we're just trying to make everyone's lives better. We want to make you guys happy. We want to make you guys laugh. And we just want to make you guys special. We want to bring some entertainment. Too. Yeah. You know, when you come home from work and you're tired and you're burned out, the last thing you want to do is watch negative shit, which a lot of people do. And the thing is, what we want to do is we want to provide different shows, uh, different entertainment, and different hosts to bring variety. That's kind of why I want to bring Shannon in. I want to bring a bunch of other people in because we want to have different types of shows, too. If I do movie reviews, she talks about TV shows, you know, she, whatever she decides to do, that's her thing. You do, and it's you, variety. You do a lot of movie reviews. I do. I do. But I also try to bring entertainment, too, and I try to bring laughs. And, and the whole thing is we want to bring something to let you unwind, you know, because it is rough. It's rough out there. It is. It's very rough you out know? there. And people are just people are just plain mean. Now, I like what Shannon said about don't drink and drive 100 percent. We're in the comfort of our own home right now. We don't have to go anywhere. We're not going anywhere. We're, we're drinking like fish. But <laughs> we actually drank more on Facebook Live. But <laughs> we we are drinking responsibly, and obviously we know how to handle our shit. Yeah. So we're not, like, drunk off our asses. Yeah, but yeah, yeah. drink responsibly. Don't drink if you're going to freaking drive, like Shannon said. Simple as that. Like yeah. I said, that's going to be one of my main things whenever I do the show because, you know, it, like, this is what it says. Like, hey, you want to go for a drink? People automatically assume that's going to be booze. Mm. It could be anything. Coffee, tea, milk, water, pop, Gatorade, anything. Anything. You know. Like I said, as long as there's some sort of a beverage mug in your hand filled with some sort of a beverage, it doesn't matter. As long as you're enjoying yourself and you're drinking and... Yeah, I can! <laughs> there Cheers. You go. Cheers. <laughs> exactly such. To all of you out there. Oh. Can I give my tutorial on Das Boot? You're a pro of this. I noticed that she's got a little Das Boot. I've got a big... Das Boot! <laughs> I've got a big Das Boot. Das Boot. Now, for those of you who have never drank out of one of these puppies, it is a tricky some bitch. So let me just give you a quick tutorial, shall I? Sure. All right. So if you drink like this, look at that. You see what happened there? You get the bubble. You get that bubble. And sometimes that shit will go right in your face. It'll go right in your face and it's booze everywhere and it's a waste of booze. It's bad. Uh, the best way to go is, as that bubble comes, turn the beer. For those of you who have seen Beer Fest, you'll get it. <laughs> <laughs> and also, Can there's another way. Beer? There's another way. You go like that. I, well. always, I always tend to, like, yeah. I go from the side and then I go to the front. Yeah. It's the best way to go. It is. So, okay. Go ahead. Sorry. No, that's cool. That's cool. <laughs> Thank you for the tutorial, Del. Error! <laughs> Error! 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 Correct. <laughs> I'm sorry, host. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to throw my candy. 
<laughs> You're still sorting through that stuff? Oh, I still got two boxes. Oh, Christ. Good to go. I'm not going to show labels. Nah. No labels, just the, uh, not the alcohol content. The, uh, they're not advertising. <laughs> yeah, nutritional content. <laughs> yes. Well, I got to You know what? Bowl. I'm curious about this. Let me see what? this. Okay, okay, go ahead. Go ahead. So. All right, let me go get another bowl. <laughs> I'm just curious here. Actually, you mean another beer while you're up? Yeah. Yeah. Cool. Awesome. Um, so apparently, <laughs> so these are the fun size candies. So obviously, you know, like they say fun size is fun size, which is lame. So, um, I'd say two out of the four candies in this box, there are 60, <laughs> there's 60 calories. And then one is 45 calories and one's 40 calories. Not that I'm counting calories, but I just wanted to say that. Calories can bite it. Um... Yes, my favorite candy is anything without nuts. No pun intended. Oh, wait, hold on. Uh -oh. You know what? What? I just realized something. You were talking about how you want to do your sound effects? I have sound effects? Go. <gasps> okay. It's the best sound in the world. Okay. Now, going back to what I said about ASMR, I might be doing this a few times when I do my show. Yeah. Check it out. Oh. Everyone, everyone, e even, everyone. Even I love this noise. Everyone be quiet. Everyone be quiet. Awesome. That is a beautiful awesome. sound. That is a beautiful, beautiful sound, folks. Love oh it. my God! Even if it's not, a, <laughs> even if it's not a beer can, a pop can, yeah, you know, a sparkling water can, doesn't matter. If it's yeah. a can, oh my God! We're making a bunch of noises here tonight, so. <laughs> and it ain't sexual either. It's just me opening the damn box. It is you opening the box. That's right. Keep it in the box. <laughs> <laughs> What's in the box? What's in the box? What's in the yeah. box? <laughs> Now this lady, she is gonna kick ass, man, and I'm hoping that we can get her set up here on on Twitch because I I want to see this woman hosting because I think she's got the stuff, she knows what she's fucking doing, and she's gonna kick ass. I don't know if she's gonna swear. Um, if you don't want me to swear, I won't. <laughs> you can swear. Because <laughs> I don't know. Because like I don't, I don't care if you swear. I'm sorry. You're a poet. You didn't even know it. <laughs> Anyways. Um, <laughs> like, yes, there, there is no occasional s curse. That's, that's, that's a given, but like, you know, like if, if it's intentional, fine, or no, wait, what I'm looking for. If it's intentional, yes, like, you know, like, oh, that guy was a fucking asshole. Fine. But if you're going to be intentional saying like, oh, that guy was da 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 and I'm sticking out of contents, then that's not right. Yeah, like every second word, word no. That's if it's every other good. word, yeah. no, that's not necessary. That's yeah. just, no, that's just bad vocabulary. We're going to swear within reason. Exactly. We're yes. going to swear within reason. <laughs> um, of course, me being Canadian, me being polite, I'm probably going to say, you know, I apologize for my French. Because ah. that's just me. <laughs> but you, you can say, like, F-bomb. You can say I will say I will say the next time. Fire truck. You know? I do say that at work sometimes. Like, if I, like, you know, like, I need to be professional at work. So, there are times, depending on who I'm dealing with, I do say fudge. But there are times, depending, again, who I'm dealing with, I will say fuck. Who knew? Who knew? But, yeah, like, I, again, I'm sure I've never been on Twitch, so I don't know what the, the protocol is. But I'm sure there's no just uh, not discrimination. Oh, um, we no, we have a disclaimer. Oh, yeah. disclaimer. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, like, uh, you have to be 18 up to see this content. Which oh. Already, yeah, they already if they're watching, they're able to. Yeah. Oh, okay. So yeah, we I put the disclaimer just because sometimes conversations get out of hand. Yeah, it's it's live. Yeah. I want I want to say live TV, but it's live video. Yeah. You don't know what's going to happen. <laughs> you don't know what who is going to say what. Oh, I want to be on the safe side, and I don't want to take any chances and have some child <laughs> watch this content. Mommy, that man take a bad word. <laughs> yeah. Hey, Dad, what's a dick? You know, I don't want that, right? <laughs> so, you know, that's just, that's why I put the disclaimer. <laughs> that's Eddie Murphy. That's Eddie Murphy. <laughs> that's just what you said. Yeah, Dad, like. what's a dick? Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> but she's going to do very well, and I know it deep in my heart because I've known this woman for a while, and I've seen her come out of her shell very, very, very quickly, and I'm telling you, you guys will not be disappointed with her content. She's going to bring the thunder. You know what I'm saying? I don't know. You were saying you don't know if you're going to be able to do an hour, but we did 45 minutes We did 45 Facebook. minutes, yes. That was amazing. No problem. That was so cool. Um, but yeah, I probably will eventually get myself a Twitch uh, account. Um, that'll probably be down the road once I get myself familiarized with what I'm doing. Also, I might as well just start with um, 
with Facebook because I have a lot of viewers on Facebook. And then I'll get myself out there and I'll start out with Twitch and see what happens. Amen, girlfriend. <laughs> Amen, girlfriend. <laughs> She's Ooh. got this stuff, man. It's warm in here. It is. We got the lights shining right down on us. <laughs> so now for those of you who are confused, again, I just want to reiterate, these are different shows. It's all under Drinking and Yak. Yes, 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 yes. It's all yes. under the same name, Drinking and Yak, and just different hosts. That's right. So it's all about, it's all like circle of friends. Yes. So. And you too. Because if you guys go to Patreon and you donate enough, we can get you to moderate and host your own show. Exactly. Whether it be here or Facebook Live, depending on where you want to do it or where you're most comfortable. And as long as it's under drinking and yakking, we're good. And doesn't matter where you're from, like no. Canada. Nope. Okay, doesn't so there matter. you go. So doesn't if you're matter. from Canada, the US, Alaska, Singapore, doesn't matter. Just people, please, please. I'm begging you, don't take my Tuesday at nine, please. That's my <laughs> that's my shit. That's my show. That's the when I do my shit. All right, don't fuck with that. All right, <laughs> that's all I ask, and that's what we're gonna be working out. Yes. So Shannon's, we're gonna figure out what day she can go on. Yes, my work yeah. schedule is very out of whack. Um, from when? Okay, I did it again. Not Wednesday. <laughs> Today is Wednesday. Wed Wednesday. Wednesday. <laughs> from Monday to Friday, I want to say I'm gonna be home between six and seven. So within a window of maybe seven and ten, mm -hmm. that'll be when I'm doing my show. I can't wait. <laughs> and then um Saturday and Sunday, um, I might be having to work until eleven. So, I mean, I want to do it. So, I want to give you guys at least a week in advance yep. when I'm going to be doing this. And if something goes wrong or if I just don't feel up to it, don't want to see me. There are times where I just don't feel like doing anything. That's right. That's I will right. give you guys notice at least a day or two in advance to let you know that there's not going to be no show, but there will be a show the day after. That's right, and so that, there are sick days too. Let's don't sick days, that. yes, yes. Because sometimes days. you're not a, you're not a hundred percent. You say you're gonna do it in a week, and then you're not there, and then obviously you have to post. Yeah, you're allowed to have so, sick days. Yes, and I, <laughs> I'm gonna say, if you have a sick day, there's no doctor's note. Yeah, you know I never understood the concept of that. Oh, the fucking doctor's note. That's so stupid. Like, if I'm you're sorry, sick see, again, like. The yeah, no, don't I worry. Swear, I'm it's, okay. it's okay. It's okay. It's okay. I know it's allowed. We're it's allowed. Drinking yeah. neck and it's all good. It's allowed. But, uh, like, the whole why, fucking doctor's note. Yeah, why, why do they make you go get a doctor's note? Like, that's so stupid. You're sick. Shouldn't you be at home? If you're well enough to get a doctor's note, you're well enough to go to work. You said it. You said it. That's right. I've seen that a lot on Facebook, like the memes. And depending on who your um, doctor is, they pay you for a fucking doctor's note. At least maybe, oh, God, I don't know, maybe at least $30, $40. And I don't understand that. Like, it's a doctor's note. Like, what do you want from us? Like, do you want me to, like, forge a note from my mom saying, yeah, my daughter can't come in because she's sick. There you go. It's like, if you're sick, you're sick. And for some reason, depending on your work, they're very anal about, like, oh, you've taken off too many sick days. You can't, you can't take off any more days. You have to come in. What if I'm, like, vomiting from my eyes? <laughs> you still want me to come in? Okay, yeah. fine. I'll come in. Vomiting from my eyes. That's nasty. That's nasty. You know what? If I, <laughs> I'm sorry. That's nasty. If I, <laughs> if I if I was a director of a horror movie, yeah, that would be awesome. That would be pretty cool. I like I love horror movies, but yeah, the whole freaking doctor's no thing. No, that's 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 bullshit. Like if you're sick, you're sick. Um, there there is like I hate calling in sick. I Me mean, personally, I hate calling in sick. Um, because I I'm a hard work. I believe myself. I'm a hard worker. I've only maybe had to call in sick maybe at least a handful of days a year. At least five days. Because I'm either very sick because, like, when I get sick, it hits me like a brick. <coughs> exactly, yeah. <laughs> when I'm sick, I'm usually in bed for at least maybe a good two, three days. Because, like, I just feel like crap. I can't move. You got that really gross, cold feeling. And then eventually, you know, you start, you get out of bed and you start walking around. It's like, yeah, okay, I'm starting to feel better. But you're still, you know, sneezing, coughing. You look like crap. You look like a ghost. And then a day after, it's like, yeah, I'm okay to go to work. I feel fine. But you, you're still sneezing and coughing. Your brain's out. I hate, that. I hate that. I feel like if you're still coughing, you should not be at work. No. Because that shit spreads. Mm. Like you ever that, see the movie Outbreak? I was just going to say that. Yeah. you see the movie Outbreak? That shit spreads. Yeah. Like, it's like no. in the air. Like It is, yeah. It's just like, no. Um, 
I just don't believe in the whole fucking sick day thing. Like, if you're sick, you're sick. But then again, <laughs> people take advantage of it. Mm. I get that. Because um, I know people at my work that, I'm going to say take advantage, but they call in sick. All the time. And I'm like, yeah. okay, you people should have been fired long ago. Which Don't, don't get me started on that. Uh, don't get me started you're on bring, that. You're bringing up the topic that, that I'm bringing up. The, people, <laughs> bringing now, up. people nowadays. Bracky baggy. They're no good. <laughs> you know, the people don't have the same work ethic, you know, because obviously we were raised a little bit differently. There's a 10 year gap between her and I, but she was actually raised properly. And I'm telling you, man, people nowadays are just stupid. You know, they don't get it. But you, you know, know, but you know what? If people don't want to work, I'll take their paycheck. Yeah. I'll work their hours. Yeah. So it's just, I don't know. I don't understand the whole sick day thing. But hey, you know what? Work is work. Whatever. Yeah, and that's why we're trying to do this full time. <laughs> you know, we would love to do entertainment like all the time. Like, dude, I would love to sort candies all the time. You know, because this is sort of what I'm doing. But it's just the it's just the whole awesome. idea. But it's the whole idea that you know we we want to bring you entertainment. I I don't want to be famous. I I want to. You just want to make an income. I want to make some kind of living doing this. I want to yeah. be able to tell people I do this for a living, and, and it'd be kind of cool. Yeah. You know? Yeah. I mean, like, with this, you know, it's fun. I'm, I'm curious. It's fun. I mean, you know, like, I love to have a hobby. You know, if I get famous, awesome. If I get, if I get an income from this, awesome. Yeah. You know, I, I'm, I'm just curious. I just want to have fun and, uh, you know, chat with the people out there. You know, that's the most important. I want you to have fun, you know, because that's what it's all about. And I'm so proud of this girl. She is a lady. Sorry. <laughs> she is awesome because she was very hesitant about all this. And now she's on board. This is her second time hosting. And I am so happy that you've decided to jump on board. And I can't wait to come home one day and <laughs> see her show posted. <laughs> right? Be awesome. And I want to thank you for helping. No, uh, no we, can't, well, we can't do that on the air. No, 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 that's not what I mean. Yeah, yeah. I want to say that. No, I want to thank you for helping me out. Yeah. And gonna be going and it's just It's my pleasure. And I will be doing some ads for you too. You know, whenever she needs an ad, if she's gonna promote, if she wants to do it. I'm her sure show. eventually I will start promoting, but yeah. I need to like design it and all that. So I don't really have much to promote right now. That's my job. That's his job. <laughs> but then, <laughs> I'm a designer. Yeah. I mean like I'm honestly like <laughs> Oh, excuse me. Oh. Like if I uh excuse me, I'm really perfect right now. <laughs> like if I uh <clears throat> drinking and yakking. <laughs> like um we had a conversation maybe uh, almost a year ago or so not even um oh. like i said if i became a co like i do cosplay but if i want to become professional um i pretty much already became or i already thought of an idea of what i would be called and you know he would help me out with like more promotion stuff oh, yeah. and so eventually i will want to promote myself yeah. And I know you'll help me out. Of course. Because this man's so artistic. Oh, it's oh. oh, my God. Um, <laughs> but, I mean, this this lady here, she was saying before that she was like, I don't know if I'm going to last five minutes, ten minutes. And, look, if we look if we look at that screen over there. Oh, someone's watching. Hey, how's it going? Someone's watching me. <laughs> do, do, do. How long have we been on? Oh, uh, go on the other screen. It'll tell us how long we've been on. Go on the OBS. Um uh, yeah, because I'm, like, shocked. Okay. Uh, we've been on 35 minutes. Oh, wow. And she was saying that she wouldn't last, you know, 10. And that's the thing, is that the show does not have to be an hour. It could be no. five minutes, half an hour, four to five minutes, two hours. It that's doesn't right. matter. That's right. It all depends on what the conversation is and who's going to be chatting with you. Mm -hmm. It doesn't matter how long it is. That's right. And that one viewer, feel free to make a comment. Yeah. You know, Please say come hi. Back. Say hi. I mean, we're not afraid. Yeah, see, so say hi. You know, we have no problems with you saying hello. That's awesome. But thank you for watching. So you've done super duper well tonight. And I, I hope just wanna, I did. Yeah, I just want to <laughs> congratulate this young lady for doing an excellent job twice. <laughs> and I can't wait to see your shows. You got. Uh, we should wrap it up. You know, um, you know. Yeah, we can wrap it up. It's yeah, getting late. We might as well. Yeah. So. All right. Well, <laughs> <laughs> thank you folks for watching. Um, again, like I said, I'll keep you folks posted. Um, I'll give you guys at least a week notice. Um, have a happy Halloween. I'm Shannon. 
Oh, we're not done yet. Let me. Let me I thought you wanted. No, this. let me promote. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm gonna. Um, okay, I'm sorry. I want to promote. Too. Okay, okay. You got something to promote? Uh, yeah, I do. Okay, I do. you got something to promote. Thank you. For, Go ahead. Thank you for asking. You're welcome. <laughs> <laughs> we gotta switch. We gotta switch. Okay. Yeah. Sorry. I I got stuff. Okay. Here. Okay. Yeah. Okay, we're going to do this again. All right, here we go. All right. So I got to go to the computer because uh, we got we to gotta promote something. All right, here we go. All right, so now let me just flick on the switch here. All right, here we go. I'm going to promote that. Drinking and yakking. Okay, that's all. That's... Is that it? I'm kidding. <laughs> Feel um, free to check us out everywhere, guys. Yes. We're everywhere, literally. Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, Patreon. Uh, we are on OnlyFans, but that's kind of... Eh, in the works. In, in the, the works. works. Yeah. And the show I do Tuesdays at 9. We don't know when she's going to do her show. Yeah, so no one... So I'm not going to take his spot. If you guys want to help out, don't take his spot. <laughs> Actually, if it's, you guys like, do want to help out, donate to Patreon. <laughs> <laughs> if, if you want to help out, awesome. Just don't take his spot. If you like Sheldon yeah. on... on Big Bang Theory. It's his spot. Don't take it. He doesn't get it. He doesn't watch TV. Uh, yeah. All right. <laughs> <laughs> I do have one more thing to promote, and that is the song. Yes. Uh, I want to thank the band. Uh, it's a song called Left from Left Turn City. It's called Lost. Uh, Left Turn City is no longer together, but they are now known as A Wasted Decade, and I want to thank those guys big time for letting me use the song for the intro and outro. And they are working on a brand new album, and I can't wait to hear it. And also, there might be... <laughs> be some song made for maybe drinking and drinking. Uh -oh. Yay! Okay, I said everything I had to say. <laughs> awesome. All right, <laughs> so this is what I'm going to do when I start doing my shows. Since it's drinking and yakking, <laughs> if you're drinking any source of alcoholic beverage, be safe. Do not drink and drive. Call home, take a cab, stay over at a friend's house. Just please stay off the roads if you've been drinking. Amen. I agree. I am Shannon. This is Del. And you're watching Drinking. And Yakin. <laughs> Happy Halloween, everybody. Be safe. <laughs> Cheers, everybody. Cheers.